Holly Clegg and you're in my trim and terrific kitchen. For today's rush hour recipe, we're gonna do a delicious and easy crawfish and corn soup. If you've never had crawfish, you're in the right place because Louisiana is always known for its crawfish. And crawfish sort of has a flavor between a shrimp and a lobster, but the best of both. And it's so versatile. You're probably familiar with crawfish etouffee and many Louisiana crawfish recipes. But think about using crawfish in a soup or some of your favorite recipes. So we're gonna just start with opening cans. That's how simple this is. So we're gonna add cream style corn two cans of cream stock corn. Let's get our heat up a little bit. And then we're gonna add two cans of Rotel tomatoes. How simple is this? It's perfect for those days you don't have time to cook and you need a quick dinner on the table. You can serve it with a little salad or sandwich. That's just tomato sauce. And here's some corn. Now, you might not think you could have crawfish year-round. You've probably heard it's seasonal, and the peak months are in the spring, but I freeze my crawfish tails all year-round so I could pop them in whatever I'm cooking. And this is just, oh, it smells good. It's so delicious. It's very family-friendly, and I promise you, everybody's gonna love it. So we're just gonna let this come to a boil, because remember, crawfish is already cooked, and then we're gonna add our Louisiana crawfish. So let me stir it and give me about five minutes, max. Okay, looks like it's hot. Basically, you're just heating up all your cans and the crawfish is already cooked. And we're gonna add it. So we're just gonna add our Louisiana crawfish. You know what's great about this recipe? I was just thinking, it's six ingredients and five minutes, and it's made with pantry-friendly ingredients. You probably have all the cans and frozen corn, and if you're smart, you have a bag of Louisiana crawfish in your freezer to pull out for a quick dinner. This looks so good. And did you know crawfish really are very low in saturated fat, and they're a high-quality protein, making this good to eat and good for you. So. I don't know about y'all, but I am starving and this looks so good. Oh, wow. Chunky. I like a soup with texture and maybe that's why I love this soup. Alrighty, and then we're gonna sprinkle with the green onions and we are ready. But you remember to look for Louisiana crawfish because the taste and the quality is so different and so much better. Alrighty, see you in the kitchen. For this recipe and a discount code for all my cookbooks, just check the link below.